Hey guys, so today's video is about Justin Bieber and why young, rich and famous guys like him should stop dating gold digging cunts, completely avoid marriage and make sure not to get any girls pregnant. And better still, stay single and go MGTOW. In other words, become one of many men going their own way, concentrating on their own life, career, family and friends, while not getting married and not risk losing their money and large fortunes to potential gold digging cunts. In recent news, Justin Bieber isn't pleased about how some of his fans are treating his new girlfriend, Sophia Ritchie, on social media. Last Sunday, the young pop star, who has been a total mangina and almost inseparable from a 17-year-old Sophia Ritchie in recent weeks, threatened to make his Instagram account private if fans don't start showing Sophia Ritchie some respect. Bieber wrote, and I quote, I'm gonna make my Instagram private if you guys didn't stop the hate, this is getting out of hand. Bieber captioned a black and white Instagram photo of himself and Ritchie. If you guys are really fans, you wouldn't be so mean to people that I like. Talking about being a fucking white knight. Bieber bro, you're acting like a complete simp. Quit being a pathetic mangina and concentrate on your career. Go and bang some quality women and leave this little bratty girl alone. Richie, the daughter of singer Lionel Richie, has been overwhelmed with nasty Instagram comments ever since being seen with Bieber. The messages range from snake emojis to much, much harsher words. And I quote, You barely know Justin, he is all about you. We've been here for 8 years and he's putting us down for your irrelevant ho ass. One user wrote, according to US Weekly. See, this is the perfect example of a female nature and how catty and conniving cunts women really are. They don't even know Justin in person and yet they are so obsessed over him to the point of sending nasty messages to his new girlfriend. And there is nothing this mangina Justin Bieber can do about it. Women despise female competition more than anything else. Even though his female fans perfectly know that he will never be with them romantically. This is why Justin Bieber should go MGTOW and spend his time concentrating on other things in life such as making even more money, traveling the world and banging as many different women as possible and without ever committing to any of them or getting girlfriends or even worse getting married. As the great professor Tom Likas says, young men in their early 20s to late 30s should never date, avoid getting into relationships, avoid getting married and make sure to never get any girls pregnant. Men in their 20s tend to be reckless when it comes to dating women and sex. Many end up marrying their girlfriends only to be divorced, miserable and broke financially within a few years time because the divorce courts always favor and take the woman's side when it comes to dividing assets. And if they also get their girlfriends or wives pregnant, then they're on the hook for child support for the next 18 years, which will destroy any possible career of finding good employment with high salary. In case of Bieber, without a prenup, he would stand to lose millions and millions of dollars to his ex. Even if he signed a prenuptial agreement, quite often judges throw them away in courts when the woman starts crying crocodile tears pretending that she was forced to sign the prenup or using a number of many other effective methods to cancel this legal document. Justin Bieber needs to put an end to all this useless female drama and go MGTOW. Here are 10 great reasons to become a man going his own way. Become fit and ripped. Research shows that most people in relationships gain weight. The percentage gets higher for people who are married. Men tend to eat more when eating with their partner rather than when they're eating alone. They also care less about their appearance because they're already taken. On the other hand, a single man want to impress the hot chicks so they have to keep themselves fit and trim to look attractive to the opposite sex. One of the biggest setbacks to a successful career is having a relationship. Having a relationship means not being able to work longer hours, doing more demanding jobs and not being able to accept the job out of town. It also means not being able to spend extra hours working on a regular basis. A blue pill committed man has the difficult task of balancing his career and relationship. Without a relationship, you can concentrate on your job, make it your priority and skyrocket to the top of the business ladder. Full control of money. Let's face it, being in a relationship is expensive. Women tend to be bottomless money pits for men in relationships. No matter how much money you throw at your girlfriend or wife, she still wants more. Sum up all the dinners, movies, flowers and gifts you bought her, not to mention the rent, bills, mortgage payments and holidays that men usually pay for. The list could go on. But if you're not in a relationship, your wallet and bank account will not suffer. 
being independent. If you're single, you do the house chores all by yourself. There will be no one to cook you dinner, wash the dishes, do the laundry or clean the house. These simple tasks men usually leave to women. Being single forces you to do all these chores by yourself. These experiences will make you a more independent young man. Better social life. When you're in a relationship, you'll spend more time with your nagging wife or girlfriend rather than your friends and family. You'll be less likely to meet new friends because you rarely go to social events and functions. If you're single, however, you're free to meet, sleep with or chat to whoever you like, whenever you like. Room for self-improvement. Just because you're single doesn't mean you have to play computer games all day long. You can get a hobby or try a new sport, learn a new musical instrument or work out in the gym. If you have the money and time, travel to countries you haven't been to. Great sleep. Being single spares you from adapting to your girlfriend's or wife's sleeping schedule and habits. These differences lead to sleep loss and feuds. Sleeping alone means your snoring is no longer a problem no matter how loud you are. You can toss and turn and have the blanket all to yourself. The only thing that will make you wake up is your alarm clock. A single man is indeed the king of his king size bed. Being spontaneous. Being in a relationship becomes like an army drill. Your girlfriend may not necessarily be a drill sergeant but your day-to-day -day life becomes a boring and repetitive pattern. You have to always plan your activities ahead of time and changing those plans will mean confirming with her first. A relationship involves planning. A single man doesn't have to plan. He can go on a fishing trip in the snap of a finger. You're the boss. When you're single, there is no sharing. You can watch football on television without the annoying woman changing the channel. You can even go to the strip club without anyone telling you off about it. You can stay out late and no one will give a shit. Flirting with all women. The unmarried man can flirt with any girl he wants. Flirting is the time to catch a lot of hot women. You master the art of attraction by meeting more girls and hanging out with them, without dating them, marrying them or getting them pregnant of course. Being a MGTOW is fun and exciting. If you are unmarried and don't have a girlfriend, you might as well enjoy these benefits because it's great being a man going his own way. Leonardo DiCaprio is the perfect example of a MGTOW, a man going his own way. He has never been married, never faced a divorce and doesn't have children so he is not liable for child support. Justin Bieber needs to spend some time with Leonardo DiCaprio to make sure that this vagina doesn't knock up some teenage girl pregnant and doesn't lose his mind and gets married to some Hollywood hoe. Leonardo DiCaprio lives this type of MGTOW lifestyle and he is much older and wiser than Justin Bieber. Leonardo DiCaprio goes through women like most men go through socks. He has a new stunning blonde in his arms every few months and when he tires of his current girlfriend he simply replaces her with another younger and prettier model. This way unmarried men like Leonardo Leonardo DiCaprio are always getting regular sex from lots of different beautiful women but he will never have to face a divorce court and his girlfriends will never be able to take half of his assets during a divorce because he will never marry them and he will not get them pregnant and he will not live with these women to avoid risking his fortune and assets. In the West and especially Hollywood, marriage serves absolutely no purpose for a man. In fact marriage is highly risky for men because over 60% of marriages end up in divorce and over 80% of divorces are initiated by women. Justin Bieber can live happy as a MGTOW well into his old age and even if he wants a younger girlfriend later on, a much better choice for him would be to hire a sugar baby, pay her a small salary and have her suck him, fuck him and do whatever Bieber bro wants her to do. Meet 63 year old Tommy and 21 year old Monty. They've been together for two years. Oh, I'm just not. I love guys. them. Well, yeah, they look great. <laughs> They're fun. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Thank you for them. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. They refer to each other as sugar daddy and sugar baby. Because, well, it's like a high five, right? Yeah. Except it's a lot better. It's powerful. <laughs> <laughs> when she needs money, Tommy's her go-to guy. And for Monty, who asks we only shoot her in profile, it's a way to get the education she can't afford. He's like, I can help you get through school easy. And you just travel with me, have fun, be around me, and just keep me company. And I said, sure, are you going to pay for my school? We observed that being a sugar baby comes with other perks. We're a little shopping today. Last June, Tommy told us he drops five grand a month on Monty. Ooh. Isn't that hot? These earrings with a pair of pie heel shoes. Great outfit. Oh, good. Whoa. God. Did you say 387? 387.25.
fine. And it's not just Monty. He's got six other sugar babies. Thank you so much. This is what we call the lost and found drawer. This is what some of my lovely sugar babies have left behind. Tommy was an IT executive who retired with enough to spend about 150000 a year on the ladies combined. When you walk into a room and you have a beautiful woman with you, it, it's a compliment to you as a male. It's, it's like pulling up in a really nice car or something, you know. I hate to compare that way, but it is. It has a good feel to it. So Monty's like a really nice car. Yeah. And like a car, these relationships might not last forever, though they start out promising. You taught me how to golf, cook, be a classy woman. He's just transferred me fast into something that I've always wanted to become. When was the last time you had a job? Almost two years ago. I'm just having fun. I'm just living life and experiencing stuff that I feel like I would never experience without him. If there were no sex involved with Monty or your other sugar babies, would you still bring them around for companionship and still give them money? No. Sexually, how have things been different for you? I mean, he's much older than you. It is what it is. Are you paying for sex with a young girl? Well, you know, you, you pay somehow, somewhere for sex, no matter what it is. You know, they say wives do it for refrigerators. You could look at I mean, I'm sure. There's somebody right now and saying that's exactly what this is. And if they want to say that, they can say that. Tommy is thrice divorced and is the father oh. of two young adults around Monty's oh. age. He meets many of his sugar babies on SeekingArrangement.com. How is it different than prostitution? If we're talking about exchange for money for sex, I don't see that this way. It's just not a wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. The courts have decreed that as long as a woman is being paid for services besides sex, such as companionship, the act does not classify it's as prostitution. So, Bieber bro, you should DTB. Dump that bitch and go MGTOW. Finally, I will leave you with a quote. A fool and his money are soon parted. In layman's terms, if you ignore my advice, the gold digging cunts are gonna rob you. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe and comment.